Drug-eluting stents, DES, have dramatically improved outcomes for patients with blocked arteries, but their long-term safety remains a concern. These stents release drugs like paclitaxel or sirolimus to prevent the overgrowth of vascular smooth muscle cells, VSMCs, a process known as restenosis. While effective, both drugs present unique risks. Paclitaxel, though widely used, has shown increased mortality rates beyond the first year of implantation, as revealed in recent meta-analyses. This raises concerns about its long-term safety. On the other hand, sirolimus offers a broader therapeutic index with lower risks, making it a preferable choice in many cases. However, even with sirolimus, issues like delayed vascular healing remain a challenge. The future of stent technology lies in addressing these limitations. Biodegradable stents, which dissolve after they've served their purpose, are emerging as potential alternatives. These stents could help reduce the risks associated with long-term drug exposure and allow for more natural vascular healing. Researchers are also exploring cell-selective drugs that target only the cells involved in restenosis, reducing off-target effects and minimizing long-term complications. These advancements may revolutionize how we approach cardiovascular care in the future, offering safer and more effective treatments for patients undergoing endovascular interventions. For more information, you can read the full study linked in the description. To stay updated on the latest in healthcare technology, be sure to subscribe to our channel.